We begin with the latest in a case that shocked many Jacksonians today. The Hines County Sheriff's Office says a man connected to a string of arsons in the city is in custody. 12 News' Brandon Rains joins us live from Epiphany Lutheran Church. Brandon? Yes, the Hines County Sheriff's Office tells us that Devin McLaurin has been arrested for starting seven fires near the Jackson State campus, including here at Epiphany Lutheran Church. The, the Sheriff's Office says McLaurin was found in Terry near Hines and Copiah County's county line Tuesday evening. McLaurin is accused of setting several, several fires Tuesday morning, including two churches, a gas station, a baseball field at JSU, and three homes. Epiphany Lutheran Church on Isaiah Montgomery Street, which was built in the 1940s, was badly damaged after McLaurin allegedly set fire to the building. State leaders, as well as Jackson residents, are outraged and saddened by the arsons. It really is just... It's heartbreaking. It's very, you know, disturbing that, uh, uh, I mean, it's tough enough as it is, but when you start dealing with, you know, God's churches, then, you know, it's really a rock bottom because this, this is not going to be tolerated, and the community is going rally, to rally around this church and uh, uh, all the other churches that were uh, affected here. And, you know, to send a message to those individuals that just won't be tolerated. I'm just spellbound that such an unjustifiable act has occurred here in the city of Jackson. This desecration of the churches is disheartening to me. I just still can't fathom that something like this has occurred. These are prolific landmarks here in the city of Jackson and they speak to our consciences so I just don't McLaurin is charged with arson. The Hines County Sheriff's Office says McLaurin will be handed over to the Jackson Police Department for further questioning. Reporting live in Jackson, I'm Brendan Rains for 12 News.